Welcome to Bears Rajah, BRS, for uh, November 23rd. We're getting ready to finish up a uh, video on this uh, tool for Tool Fest 2021. And uh, made a little sign here so we can see this. I don't know if the bride can zoom in. Uh, Lear, can you see this all right? Yes. But uh, we are not uh, machinists by all means. We are hobbyists. Now, I didn't start until I was in my late 60s, and uh, about three, four years ago, got my first lathe in a mill, and then I got hooked on stairs, and it could go on and on, brown sharp. But my entry for Too Fest uh, 2021 is an indexer, and uh, shop built. And let's lay this over here out of the way, and maybe I can explain a little about this indexer and how I got started. Uh, a lot of uh, creators out there making indexers and I love uh, to watch them and got a lot of good ideas. Won't go through all their names. Uh, you know who you are and those that have made them. One of them though that I want to got me really started was this uh, simple uh, design here from uh, Advanced Innovations and uh, really simple and you can see the three circles so you get a hexagon and an octagon and pentagon and all oh, just numerous things and then it's got these pins let's put it up here real quick i'm just gonna kind of eyeball this in here and we're not going to mess with it but you could indicate off the side with your one two three blocks I'm not going to go get my one, two, three box for this video sake, but this is a perfectly uh, parallel square block. Came out of the uh, Dodge. And then the dowel pins that go across, I've got them so for video sake you can see the outer ring. And then these series of holes, these outer ones right here, go to the outer. And then you could sweep the top with an indicator. Uh, it has the pins that go in here. Well, for sake of video, uh, we're not talking about this particular one, but then you, you can kind of get the idea. And you can also visit uh, Advanced Innovations, Mr. Joe Pye over there, and uh, see that video. This is my concept. Took a rough uh, big piece of stock. It was five inches at, at uh, the beginning. And it was about four inches thick. I didn't need that much bulk. But here we are. We're down here at, uh, and I don't want to have to go over all the dimensions. And it is 3741. Yeah, I'll have to set this down. But uh, almost four inches across. Uh, here is the, uh, of course, the hexagon out here and then the octagon on the back. And, of course, we can get many more readings just like we can with this one. Uh, two inch and two thou over, uh, but it's just a little over two thou over two inch. And then I made a bushing here. It's an inch and three quarter. You'll see here on the front, there's a crow's foot here. And then there's a crow's foot right here so match up that way if I was off on one hole instead of drilling an individual and then we will set this real quick I'm only going to run one set screw now I've come in here and there's plenty of room to put your square up off your bed there's a uh, ample room here and when these are down actually squeeze them down into the one inch stock they'll be down flush you could run them right down now but for putting in an inch and three quarter they are going to stick up was no sense in me going and getting different screws when a one inch quarter 20 worked for all four holding could probably got away with two but i wanted to make sure that for fine adjustment i had ways to uh, squeeze a piece of pipe. In other words, here's a, an old collar off of a tractor and uh, just a random cut off piece. Well, we're gonna have to back this one out a little bit here. 
run it down a little farther. And uh, what's nice, it's just an eight, one eighth Allen wrench. Goes right with you out in the field or in the shop. Now, you can clamp this down. And also, without it, you can put the one inch in here. I was going to make a bushing for it. Going to find out I didn't need another bushing because I can just set this and then I can sweep and uh, very little effort. And then we can get down even into a three quarter. Let's take off that one. Now, this is three quarter coal row, and I'm about uh, one and a half thou over. Uh, if I get into where I've got a piece that's warped, but then I can actually, that's all you need. Uh, basically, I'm, uh, I'm finished with this project now, and it can go to use. And uh, hope you guys like uh, this bill for Tool Fest 2021. And uh, have a safe, safe uh, holiday season, Thanksgiving coming up here, and uh, Christmas. And may everybody be safe. And uh, uh, we're going to have a hoot out there on this Tool Fest. I can't wait to start watching uh, other creators, and I'm going to be glued to that uh, YouTube screen. Bear's Rod Shop, please give us a thumbs up. Please subscribe and please share. Also visit us at Facebook, uh, Bear's Rod Shop, because you creators out there, and I'll get a really good video. I'll put them on for a couple of months, and then we'll put somebody else on. But you are getting exposure from Bears Rod Shop, and we hope uh, the same from y'all. Bears Rod Shop, we're out of here. Have a safe holiday.